This is question one from paper one of the 2015 SQA Curriculum for Excellence Higher Maths exam. We're given a couple of vectors. Vector u, which has components 8, 2, minus 1. Let's write it in column form. And vector v, which has components negative 3, t, and minus 6. And we're told that these two vectors are perpendicular. We're asked to find the value of t. Now, the result we're going to use is if two vectors, u and v, are perpendicular, then the dot product, u dot v, will be equal to 0. And remember, definition of dot product, if you have couple of vectors u and v with components a, b, c, d, e, f for instance, then dot products easily got by multiplying the corresponding numbers that are the, the components uh, together. a, d, the x components multiplied, b, e in this case, the y components and c, f, the z components together. And that's a, a number, it's not a vector. So in this case, we could say that since vector u is perpendicular to vector v, then u dot v will be equal to 0. So this vector dot this vector will be equal to 0. And let's multiply these corresponding components. We'll have 8 times negative 3. It's the x components multiplied. 2 times t. It's the y components multiplied. And negative 1 times negative 6. That's the z components multiplied. That all comes to 0 since the vectors are perpendicular. So that's negative 24 plus 2t plus 6. Negative times negative is positive. Equals uh, 0. Now, negative 24 plus 6 is negative 18. And therefore we've got 2t, let's add 18 to both sides. 2t is equal to 18, therefore t is equal to 9. And that's the missing value that we were after.